So that story with Nomar that I was trying to tell last time is he was telling Danny just line drives the other way back at the L screen. He said if his first time up, Nomar hit a line drive to second base, he'd go by the manager and say, it's going to be a special night tonight. And Nomar would go as far to tell Danny, if I stayed back and lined a ball over the first base dugout and I took it out of the catcher's glove, I knew I was locked in. Because I had to wait, 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 and I knew if I could take it out of the catcher's glove and smoke it over my own dugout, that the rest would take care of itself. And he was talking about not trying to hit home runs in batting practice, just low line drives the other way and try to wear out the L screen where the batting practice pitchers throw in. And the home runs will be byproducts of your batting practice because the adrenaline will take over in the game and you'll pull the ball naturally. Just great stuff that I was lucky enough to witness around the cage today. And Danny just soaking it all in. You know, one shortstop to another. It was great stuff. There he goes. Opposite field. Jay Sutley couldn't get it. Sutley tried to time his jump and probably did. Just about a glove too short. Danny Espinosa, two for three tonight. Well, maybe Nomar had something to do with that line drive over second base. Who knows? A home run last time, and then he goes with the pitch, floats it over Chase Utley's head. So Casimir hoping his second baseman could get up and get it. Not the case, and Danny Espinosa with his second hit of the night.